To ensure your safety, switch the machine off in these situations. While sewing, keep an eye on the needle and keep hands away from all the moving parts. Raise the support rod fully, turning slightly until the positioning catches engage. Position the thread guide on the thread stand so that the arrow is to the front. Attach the separately packed spool holder to the fixed spool holder by pushing it until it snaps in place. The anti-vibration cone should be used with the wider edge at the bottom on the spool holder pin when sewing with cones. If large industrial spools are used, position the anti-vibration cone upside down on the spool holder pin i.e. with the wider edge at the top. Remove the anti-vibration cones. Place spools on spool holder pins and push the spool caps on with the rounded side downwards. If the threads slip and get twisted, cover the spool of looper with the net supplied in the accessory bag. Switch the machine off before attaching the foot control. Plug the foot control into the machine socket and then into the main socket. Switch the machine on. The foot control regulates the sewing speed. The sewing speed can be adjusted by increasing or decreasing the pressure on the foot control. To raise the presser foot, push the presser foot lifter up. It can be raised again to maximum height. To lower the presser foot, press the lifter down. When using the extra lift, do not run the machine or turn the hand wheel. Switch the machine off before changing the presser foot. Turn the hand wheel to raise the needles. Raise the presser foot. To release the presser foot, press the catch. Raise the presser foot shaft to its highest position and remove the presser foot to the left. To attach the foot, place it under the shank so that the groove in the shank lines up exactly with the presser foot pin. Lower the shank and the presser foot will engage automatically. Lower the presser foot lifting lever and check that the groove in the shank should line up exactly with the presser foot pin. If it is not lined up, press the catch to line up. To open, push to the right and tilt the cover towards you. To close, push it up. Switch the machine off before opening the cloth plate. To open, push the cloth plate to the left. To close, push it towards the machine and press gently until it engages. The hand wheel turns forward when sewing. Switch the machine off before changing the needles. Raise the needles fully by turning the hand wheel. Lower the presser foot. To remove the needles, loosen the needle set screws.
Use this needle. Place a needle flat side towards the back into the hole of the needle inserter. Insert the needle into the needle clamp. Tighten the needle set screws 